What is up my crew of Epic Awesome subscribers? Welcome back to the Survivor Let's Play. Yes indeed, we're here once again. We're here. How you doing? <laughs> Woo! Listen guys, last episode was absolutely epically awesome. We found four villagers, four temples, leaving us at this village right here. No, but seriously guys, we have a lot to do now because I don't know what to do. <laughs> We have a lot to do, but I don't know what to do. <laughs> that is that is my theory in this game. No, but I don't know where to settle down. I've been reading up on your comments, and I don't know, oh boy, what you're doing. Is that bunny floating under water? This bunny is Jesus. No, but seriously, guys, I know there was grasslands somewhere around here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Look at this, guys, building already. Um, I don't know if I'm going to settle down in this village just yet, but we have to get a... We need to get a good view of what, what we're dealing with here, guys. It's all its all about the view. What have we got here? Right, we got one village down there, another village down there, temple over there, trees. Trees, trees, a lot of trees, a lot of mountains, guys. We need mountains for emeralds. Um, this place seems like a good place to build. I don't know, guys. I don't know what to do. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh. I'm losing my nuggets. I just have this feeling there could be a grassland village right down there in those, in those trees. There could be, there could be. Right, you know what, let's... Uh, what would I do if I wasn't recording? If I was on my own, I would probably still go adventuring. Be careful, dude, you're gonna... I broke my leg. Okay, so this is not a massive cave, but it's pretty decent. It's pretty decent. So should we start building, or should we start running away? Let me just take a close peek at the grasslands and make sure there is not... There is not any villagers that were missing. Although, you know what we could do, guys? We could actually start building a medieval city village in the grasslands. And then we can grab the villagers from the village on a, on a railway car and just chuck them all over into our city. Oh my god, and there's some donkeys down there as well. We could use that for traveling resources. Traveling resources. Because tra resources do that, they travel. Right, let's sleep before we get ahead of ourselves. We need to, we really need to just focus and decide what, what it is we're going to do. Some of you guys said, you know, Jerocraft, build a ginormous, a ginormous desert city village. And that's fine. That's fine. That's a good idea. But I really like building on grasslands rather than building on the desert. I am going to find myself a good spot right in these grasslands. And I'm going to start building myself my house, my first starter house. And we're going to start our own freaking village. We don't need no Minecraft villages. We're gonna build my. Oh, is that a village? Like we we have, we literally have cows, pigs, pumpkins, grasslands, trees. This it's a perfect place to build, guys. And then we can get the villagers from the desert land and bring them over here using a minecart, some rail rail blah, 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 blah. railway tracks. Is what I'm gonna say. So we're gonna do that, guys. I, I need to eat some food before I starve myself to death. I'm eating a golden apple because I don't give up. I should not swear in my videos. Where can we start building the first house? Right next to these mountains. Let's build it right here. Or oh, we should build on top of a hill. Oh boy, guys. How about a bridge from here to here and the castle can go on top of this hill? Get in, lads. Get in. That is a perfect idea. We're going to start building our house right here. Our first house is going to be here. I'm gonna start building, I'm gonna start building, building my epic house, hey hey, I'm gonna set up my shop, and I'm gonna hop, and I'm gonna cut down some crops. <laughs> so all we need to do is we need to set up a crafting table, we got ourselves a crafting table, got ourselves a furnace, that's a great start to the building, ho ho, start cooking up them pork chops, cause we need some pork chops to survive, woo! Guys, we need to start cutting down a bunch of trees and we need to plant some more trees as well so that we can have a tree farm because trees are cool and trees give us wood and wood makes us houses and building houses makes us cities and the cities builds. Never mind. We need to set up a massive, massive city, guys. This is going to be the biggest survival let's build, buildy, buildy of epical awesomeness that you guys are ever going to see. Ever. It looks amazing. We shall start building because it is our fate to build and succeed in this epical awesome lands. I shall be the king of this city and I will take over the desert lands. I have a feeling we need to cut down a lot of trees. 
I forgot we're not doing this in, in creative mode, guys. This ain't no creative mode. We need to seriously cut down a bunch of trees. You see all those trees down there? That's where I'm heading right now. I'm going to cut down as many trees as I can, and then I'll get back to you because I don't think you guys want to watch me cut some trees, do you? Do you? Do you want to watch me cut some trees? Do you? Really? I didn't think so. We got some lovely caves here to explore as well, guys. There's also some caves. There's actually a bunch of caves. The extreme hills tend to have a lot of caves. So we're definitely gonna go. We're definitely gonna do some caving later on. Okay. Woo! Oh my god, I got myself a full stack already. I've been cutting down a bunch of trees and guys, I really hope you guys are not gonna overreact about my decision because I, I think this is a good decision, okay? We're gonna be building a castle, medieval castle. I don't wanna build on a desert, but trust me, we will expand to the desert later on. Maybe we, we can get some kingdoms going on and join up a bunch of villagers. We'll build a massive city. Who knows, who knows? And I, I literally, guys, I read almost every single comment. Like, I know I don't reply to all of them because I do not have the time. If you guys knew, what I'm going through just to upload daily videos, you'll be like, Jerocraft, get a life. <laughs> right, that's it, guys. My axe is destroyed. I need to find myself a new axe. Uh, I think we do have a lot of iron left over still, so we should be fine. So just to get a clear image, guys, you can see that the village is just over there. We're going to build our castle right here on this hill. There's our house down there. Um, so we should, be, we should be good to go, guys. We should be fine. Wait, what's that down there? I keep thinking there's a village in these grasslands. There might be a village somewhere down here, but it could be quite useful actually. Seeing as we do have the extreme hills, we're going to find a lot of emeralds as well. Not sure how big that biome is, but it better be pretty big, because if not, we're not going to be finding many, many, many emeralds, aren't we, Mr. Squid? It's all about the squid, it's all about the caramales. Caramales, gamba, salpilpil, all that good stuff. Oh, I need, an, I, need, I need another axe. Can we build another axe? Come on, guys. We can do this. We've got 19 iron still left over, so we've got plenty for tools and things. Ah, I need some sticks first. What am I doing? Get your stuff together, man. Get your stuff together. That is not an axe. That's a pickaxe, Jerocraft. What is wrong with you, mate? Either way, I'm going to remove this whole platform here anyway. Because I'm going to need to kind of flatten this out if we're going to have bridges and things. I mean, the city isn't going to be a pile of poop. It's not going to be like a mountainous area it needs to be nice and flat just as flat as this cow's head mm. i didn't expect to be terraforming already but it looks like we need to we're planning out a massive city guys i think it's going to be a lot of fun because you guys are going to see me progress and build a city step by step each episode getting more and more closer to building a huge city and you guys can just see the progression and kind of play along give me some tips it's going to be you know quite interesting like you see this hole right here we're gonna fill this in right away. You know, this survival let's play is the best way for you guys to see how I play Minecraft. And not just survival wise, but building wise. Like, we're, we're gonna start off by building our survival house, which we have. And I've collected just enough dirt to kind of fix this, extend it. We'll have a garden somewhere. I don't even know, guys. I mean, there's a lot of uneven landscape. I mean, we should be able to work with this. Okay, that should be good enough. Looking good, guys. Looking good. The thing is, I'm going to need some cobblestone if I'm going to, like, add in any extra detail and stuff. And I just realized this is not symmetrical. <laughs> I need to expand on this, damn it. You know how, how I am with OCD? I just can't have this. I cannot. It needs to be all symmetrical. If not, uh, if not, I just lose my, uh, my nuggets. I start losing my nuggets. And you do not want to see Jerocraft lose his nuggets. Like, you still have not seen Jerocraft lose his nuggets. When Jerocraft loses his nuggets... Then he's gonna go freaking McNugget on you. I'm not even kidding. Not on you, but like on the game and on... You know what I mean. Oh my god, guys! <laughs> I freaking left my bed down there! No! We need to get the bed! Why aren't you running? What are you doing, woman? I can't believe I left my bed in the trees. Please don't go dark just yet. We do have a lot of sheep as well, guys. We actually have pigs, sheep and cows. So we're kind of sorted when it comes to food and wool and all that good stuff. Oh my god, guys, where's my bed? Here it is, here it is. It's all good, it's all good. What is a Minecraft builder's worst nightmare? Creeper is, a creeper I think is a builder's worst nightmare, especially in survival. And those things are silent as hell, man. You can't hear those things creep up to you. 
and then just blow your chin off your face. Let's go for a side entrance, maybe have like a garden on this side. The fireplace can go over here as well. I'm going to have a three block gap right here. I'm going to have space for a fireplace. It's going to be a big house, guys. It has to be. You know what, guys? I've been stupid again. Yeah, I've been really stupid because I've been placing all this dirt on the ground, but we need to place a flooring anyway, so I don't know... I don't know why, why I've done that. We need to actually clear out all this grass anyway if we're going to build a house. Ay, 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 madre. Look at the size of this house. It's coming along just great. This is where the fireplace is going to be. We're going to have the back garden right here. Um, living room somewhere in the middle. Storage. I guess I'll make a basement. I don't know, guys. It's going to be a pretty massive house. Trust me. And there goes my shovel. It's gone. It's broken. I've just kind of cleared out as much as I can, guys. I've, bear with me. This is annoying. I'm not used to playing in, in survival mode, but it's fun. It's fun because we get to explore. We get to survive. Um, I'm really hoping that I don't die because if we die, then I don't know what we're going to do because I don't know how to get back, guys. I, I don't know how to get back to this place. Like, seriously, why am I doing these hand signals? What's this all about? The computer gives off so much heat. It's like a, it's like a free, free oven. <laughs> it's a free oven. I can cook my pizza inside my computer. That's how hot it gets. And it has liquid cooling and three or four fans. Guys, we have no option but to go mining. So I'm going to do a little bit of mining in this episode because we need cobblestone anyway. We're going to go over to the cave, see if we can find any iron and stuff and, and get going. Maybe we might even find some diamonds. Who knows? Okay, that's it, guys. I have the frame of the house complete. Take a look at this. It's a pretty big frame. I might even make the house a bit smaller by putting full blocks on the inside and have some stair blocks on the edges. I know it's hard to kind of figure it out what I'm trying to explain here, but when I have it done, you kind of understand. And the inside will be a lot smaller than the outside. It, that's kind of my design theory here. And yes, 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 guys, I've been reading the comments. You guys told me not to spam click to do that instead. You know, let the iron cook in the furnace before you swing that iron about because if not it doesn't do as much damage so thank you guys for the tips i just haven't played minecraft in so long uh, i don't even know what i'm doing anymore seriously i'm gonna cook up this raw beef and then we'll have enough food to go mining i might just leave the mining for the next episode though i'm not too sure i don't even know how long i've been recording for to be honest oh my god what am i doing there's just a bunch of spiders in there guys there could even be there could even be some mine shafts in there that would be amazing Right, guys, I also have 35 iron, so I can definitely smelt that away and get some iron armor, full set of iron armor, so at least we're a bit safer when we go into those caves. I do not want to, I don't plan on getting blown up by a creeper in a single hit, so <laughs> this should help. I should have enough already, guys. Chest plates, iron leggings, iron boots, and the iron helmet. There we go, guys. Look at that. We are almost ready to go, aren't we? Yo, Mr. Cow, how you doing? Are you looking mighty fine with those legs? What you brewing? Oh! <laughs> right, guys, we are ready to go. We got some We got some armor. We got a pickaxe. We got some iron tools. A sword. Two swords, actually. Enough food. A bed. I think we should... We're pretty much good to go, guys. I'm not scared that the... I'm literally not scared at all because I'm listening to my own music. And I, when I listen to my own music, I really don't care. I'm, I'm actually scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. It's a creeper. Take a chill pill, Mr. Creeper. Don't blow up in my face. Because you're a disgrace. And you just did it. You had to do it, didn't you? Okay, guys. It's a fresh day. It's a fresh day. We got some coal over here. I'm going to mine all this coal up because we need it. Mining some coal in this hole. What the mole is that? Oh, my God. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Mr. Mole Spider, I got you. This is all chills, man. This is chills. It's not even hurting me. Wow. Mining some coal in this hole, and I just killed a mole. What? Okay, Mr. Sheep, I think we should end this episode here, shouldn't we? Because we don't want to die in no caves, and we don't seem to find anything good. How much cobblestone do I have? 36 cobblestone, that's not near enough. But guys, we shall continue exploring in the next episode, and hopefully continue building our house and get it all finished and ready for survival. Thank you for watching today's episode, guys. This is Jerocraft over and out.